Hello, I am Leopold Armesto. Um, you probably know about me because I have developed a set of video tutorials about Copelisim. And this video is about uh, what happens when Copelli Robotics uh, releases a new version of Copelia Sim and without notice, uh, the old version stops working. Actually, let me show you exactly what happens. If you run, if you try to run the software, I'm I'm working right now with the version 4.2.0, and the 4.3 version it's released now. It says here leaving, and without any kind of warning error or something like that, it stops working. Okay, you might have to understand that as an academic, this is a very um, inappropriate uh, behavior of the software because when you are running the software in a in a computer lab and you try to expect uh, to to use it for let's say lab sessions then uh, this behavior is totally uh, uh, undesirable okay um Copilot robotics actually it's trying to uh, it's trying to force us to update to the new version by, by doing this but Actually, uh, updating to a new version has to be done with caution because the API that was working for previous versions is not always uh, compatible with the new version. So you have to be care uh, careful about that, okay? So what to do in that case? What you have to do is you have to go to uh, program files, okay? This is in Spanish, but in, in English is program files, okay? And inside program files, you will find the folder Copilot Robotics and then Copilisim Edu. And then inside this folder, there's a system folder, okay, and a file which is user set txt. You have to open this file here, and this line here, you see the first line, it's not included by default when you have installed the software, but uh, if you Google on the Copilisim forum, then you can find that the, the the maintainers and uh, this uh, they, they mentioned that you have to include this line in this file so actually uh, i'm going to uncomment this line save it and now if i run the software you will see that everything works as expected the problem is that uh, this line here at uh, the port that you're trying to access depends on the version okay the one you've seen before it's only valid for the version 4.2.0, okay? And if you have, uh, let's say, uh, in next year, uh, you have already installed the 4.3.0 and then you have to update, probably this number has to be, uh, is different and you have to Google for it, okay? Thank you very much.